A Royal Rumble, The Surprising Tale of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle in Court. In the glittering world of royals and tabloids, where every whisper becomes a headline, the saga of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle continues to twist and turn, capturing the hearts and minds of millions. Just when you thought you had heard it all, a bizarre and sensational story emerges, Prince Harry dragging Meghan to court over allegations of mixing sleeping pills into his food and drink, while allegedly calling their bodyguards to beat him up. You might think this sounds like a plot from a dramatic soap opera, but it's all too real in the world of modern royalty. Buckle up, dear reader, as we dive into this captivating tale filled with intrigue, drama, and a touch of the absurd. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's love story was once the stuff of fairy tales. He was the charming prince, and she was the American actress who captured his heart. Their engagement and wedding were celebrated around the globe, and for a brief moment, it seemed as if they had found their happily ever after. However, as we all know, fairy tales often come with unexpected twists. The couple's decision to step back from royal duties and move to California was met with mixed reactions. Suddenly, they were no longer just a royal couple, they became global icons, advocates for mental health, and targets for relentless media scrutiny. The pressure was immense, and the once enchanted life began to feel like a gilded cage. Fast forward to the present day, and we find ourselves facing a shocking claim, Prince Harry has taken Meghan to court over serious allegations involving sleeping pills and their bodyguards. Let's unpack this sensational story. According to reports, Harry alleges that Meghan has been secretly mixing ground sleeping pills into his meals and drinks, aiming to control his behavior and keep him subdued. This bombshell claim paints a picture of a tumultuous relationship plagued by manipulation and mistrust. But what could have compelled Meghan to resort to such drastic measures? Was it desperation, fear, or something more sinister? Adding another layer of intrigue, Harry claims that Meghan called their bodyguards to physically confront him. Just imagine, a prince, usually surrounded by grandeur and protocol, being allegedly attacked by his own security team. It's a wild image that seems straight out of a Hollywood thriller. As the courtroom doors swing open, the atmosphere is charged with anticipation. The media frenzy surrounding the case is palpable, with cameras flashing and reporters eagerly awaiting every morsel of information. Inside, the drama unfolds like a gripping novel. Prince Harry, known for his candidness and emotional vulnerability, takes the stand. With his trademark charisma, he recounts the unsettling experiences he endured. The audience hangs on his every word, feeling the weight of his story. He speaks of sleepless nights, paranoia, and the gnawing feeling that something was terribly wrong. Then, Meghan's side of the story emerges. She presents a contrasting narrative, claiming that Harry's allegations are exaggerated and that they stem from a deep-seated fear of losing control. Her defense paints her as a loving partner, desperate to help her husband navigate the pressures of fame. The courtroom becomes a battleground for two narratives, each compelling in its own right. As the trial progresses, the media circus surrounding the case only intensifies. Tabloids thrive on the drama, crafting sensational headlines that blur the lines between fact and fiction. Sleeping pills and bodyguards, the royal scandal, screams one headline, while another suggests that this could be the end of their marriage. The public, too, finds themselves divided. Some sympathize with Harry, viewing him as a vulnerable figure caught in a web of manipulation. Others rally behind Meghan, seeing her as a strong woman fighting against the constraints of royal life. The story transcends the couple, igniting larger conversations about mental health, control, and the pressures of fame. As the courtroom drama unfolds, it raises profound questions about love, control, and the quest for freedom. In a world where fame often feels like a double-edged sword, how do couples navigate the turbulent waters of public scrutiny? How do they maintain their individuality while being part of a larger narrative? Harry and Meghan's story resonates with many who have experienced the complexities of relationships. Love can be a beautiful thing, but it can also bring out the worst in people when insecurities and fears take over. 
the allegations of control and manipulation highlight the darker side of relationships, reminding us that even the most glamorous couples can face tumultuous struggles behind closed doors. As the trial nears its conclusion, speculation grows about the future of Harry and Meghan's relationship. Will this court case bring them closer together, or will it drive them further apart? The outcome remains uncertain, but one thing is clear, the couple's journey is far from over. In the age of social media and instant news, each new development is met with a flurry of opinions. Fans and critics alike speculate about the potential fallout, while the couple's supporters rally to defend their choices. The world watches with bated breath, eager to see how this royal saga will unfold. As we reflect on this captivating tale of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, we are reminded of the complexities of love and the challenges that come with fame. Their journey, filled with ups and downs, serves as a poignant reminder that even in the world of royalty, life can be chaotic and unpredictable. Whether you find yourself rooting for Harry, Meghan, or both, one thing is certain, their story is far from over. As they navigate the courtroom drama and the media frenzy, we are left to wonder what the future holds for this once enchanted couple. Will they emerge stronger, or will the pressures of fame prove too much to bear? Only time will tell, but for now, their story continues to captivate and inspire, proving that even in the most extraordinary lives, the human experience remains deeply relatable.